facts that will genuinely make your life easier. Buy from lesser known keyboard shortcuts to hidden settings on computers and smartphones. Here are 10 tech hack that will make your life easier. 10 tech hacks that will genuinely make your life easier. Computers and smartphones have become an integral part of our lives. And they're packed with helpful features that can make common tasks a breeze. For instance, conducting a Google search can be made simpler. With search operators and specific keyboard shortcuts can save users from going about things the long way. Other features, like the night light on Windows, are meant to protect users from the potentially harmful effects of looking at screens all day. Some of the most useful features on computers and smartphones are among the least known. From giving yourself more time to unsend emails, to using speech to text, to assist with typing. Tweaking the settings of apps used every day can make a world of difference. Here are some simple hacks that can make life a bit easier. 10. Increase the time you have to unsend emails on Gmail. Gmail's in-to-send feature can be a lifesaver, especially if users realize they've made a mistake after pressing the send button. By default, the in-to-send button only appears for 5 seconds after an email is sent, which might not be enough for some users. The good news is that users can increase the undescend window from Gmail for desktops. To do this in Gmail, click the settings icon in the top right corner and select see all settings. Search for the undescend option and from the send cancellation period menu, choose an option from 10, 20, and 30 seconds. 9 mute and annoying email thread. Email threads can be annoying, especially when several people at the office are constantly sending replies on the same mail trail. Luckily, Gmail allows users to mute email threads, preventing unnecessary notifications. To do this, open the email thread, tap on the three dots at the top of the interface, and select mute from the available options. To view the conversation, users can select the all mail option from the sidebar on the left. It use Google search operators for users who have trouble getting relevant Google search results. There are special commands known as search operators that can help. Using these operators, users can make their searches more precise. For instance, the site Operator returns specific results from a particular website. Typing site Colin Screen Rant.com Apple Vision Pro, for example, will display all articles that contain the Apple Vision Pro keyword published on the website. Then there's the operator that can find results excluding a specific word. Another search operator is weather, location name. Just enter the location name to see the weather forecast for that specific place. To search for entries related to a particular date, users can use the before or after operators. To give a clear idea, typing site, screen rent, calm Apple Vision Pro after the 10th of March 2023 iPhone fetches all the results that contain the keyword Apple Vision Pro published after March 10th, 2023 and don't have the keyword iPhone. 7. Enable the night light feature on your computer. For those who use their computers at night, there's an inbuilt night light feature in Windows and MacOS that controls the color temperature and minimizes blue light which can be harmful to the eyes. To enable the feature on Windows, type night light in the search bar, click on the first result, and select turn on now. Mac users will need to click the Apple menu in the top menu bar 
and select system settings. Go to displays and click on night shift. From here, users can turn on night shift, schedule it for a particular time, and adjust the color temperature. Six learn these keyboard shortcuts. Yet another tech hack that makes users' life easier is keyboard shortcuts. On Windows, the well-known ones include CTRL++ C2 copy, CTRL++ V2 paste, and CTRL++ X to cut items. However, users can do a lot more with keyboard shortcuts. For example, pressing Windows++ T takes users to the desktop. Pressing the spacebar scrolls down on a web page, and pressing shift plus plus spacebar scrolls up. On Marco's finder, pressing CMD plus plus to switches to list view, CMD plus plus three switches to column view, and CMD plus plus for changes to gallery view. While using Google Chrome, Windows users can press trust shift plus plus T. And Marcos users can press CMD plus plus shift plus plus T to reopen previously closed tabs. Similarly, Windows users can access the downloads page by pressing CT or L plus plus J, while Marcos users can press CMD shift plus plus J. To open the history page, Windows users should use the shortcut CT or L plus plus H while Marcos users can use CMD plus Y. Last but not least, pressing CT or L plus plus L immediately takes users to the search bar and helps to type quick commands. Five use speech to text for typing. Several word processing apps provide speech to text, a feature that can help users if they can't or don't want to type manually. The feature is available on MS Word and Google Docs, and both work seamlessly. To set it up, Windows users should first enable online speech recognition from the settings menu, and then press star plus plus H key to use it. On Google Docs, users can press CT or L plus plus shift plus plus S to enable voice typing. On Marcos, Users should head to Apple menu greater than greater than system settings greater than keyboard. Then select dictation and turn it on. Once the feature is enabled, place the cursor at the insertion point and press the microphone icon if available on the function keys to start dictation. Otherwise, select edit greater than greater than start dictation for Take screenshots like a pro. Most people know the standard way of taking screenshots. Pressing the PRTSC key on Windows computers or pressing the CMD plus plus shift plus plus three keys on a Marcos device. However, both operating systems provide better ways to take screenshots wherein users can select only the required part from their screen. To do this, Windows users should press star plus plus shift plus plus as to invoke the snipping tool, and then use the mouse trackpad to select an area on the screen. On the other hand, Marcos users should press CMD shift plus plus five keys together to access the screen capture window that allows users to capture specific parts of a screen. 3. Recover deleted photos It is common to delete photos in haste and regret doing so later. However, Android and iOS users can recover deleted photos, at least for a limited time, after removing them. Android users who use Google Photos can access deleted photos for up to 60 days by going to Google Photos greater than library greater than greater than bin. However, it is important to mention that only images deleted via Google Photos appear in the bin. Similarly, 
iOS users can find deleted pictures and recently deleted greater than photos for up to 30 days. To offer guests with a QR code for sharing Wi-Fi. This is a tip that works better for Android users. Instead of sharing the Wi-Fi password manually, Android users can generate a QR code for the Wi-Fi network, allowing other users to join the network. Just head to the Wi-Fi network menu in settings, tap on the settings icon next to the connected WI, the network's name, and hit the QR code button at the bottom. The person who wants to join the network should head to the Wi-Fi settings menu and tap the scanner button in the top right corner of the screen so they can scan the code. One use chat to write emails, captions, and more. The last tech hack that could help users save time is using chat for mundane tasks such as writing basic emails, formal invitations, customer complaints, etc. The language processing tool can generate grammatically sound, easy to read text ready to send. All users need to do is provide the tool with some context, mention their tone and style preferences, and any other required information, such as dates or names, and that's it.